I'm glad we're gonna get a chance to practice together. Yeah, let's do it! Okay, Grovile, I choose you! Grovile! Squirtle, use Ice Beam! Squirtle! Grovile, Leaf Blade, go! Huh? Wow! Look at that! Even the leaves are frozen solid! Yeah, but so is Grovile! Squirtle! Don't worry! I've got an idea! Okay, Combuskin, warm it up! Use Fire Spin! Combuskin! Huh? huh? Whoa! <gasps> Grovile! That was awesome! Yeah! It looked like magic! How did that even happen? Combustion? You know, sometimes when I'm boiling water to make pasta, a thick cloud of steam comes off too. Just like that. Yeah, but what makes steam? We should figure it out before we go to a real battle and blow an attack. Yeah, I think we need to call CR and find out what's going on here. Great idea! Hey, Rock, Ash, and May. What's going on? Hey, Ciara! We were practicing with our Pokemon, but a weird thing just happened. I told Squirtle to use Ice Beam. And that trapped my Grovile in a block of ice. So I told my Combuskin to use Fire Spin to melt the ice. Yeah, and then it just made this cloud of steam. Like when I'm boiling water. So we want to know, what happened exactly? Hmm, sounds like a classic case of evaporation. Huh? Well, let's start with water, which is a liquid. Liquids are like soda or mouthwash or window cleaner. And liquids can evaporate or become a gas like that cool cloud of steam you saw. Wow, really? How? Well, to understand evaporation, you first have to understand the three states of matter. What does that have to do with it? Matter is everything. Everything is made up of matter, and there are three main kinds, solid, liquid, and gas. Solids are things that have a definite size and shape, like this chair I'm sitting in, or a bicycle, or a computer, anything that is solid. Solid as a rock! You got it. Solids are solid because the particles that make up the object are packed in tight, and they may vibrate or jiggle, but basically they're not going anywhere. But what if the particles aren't packed that tight? Well, that's where liquids come in. Liquids have particles that are close together, but in no particular shape. That's because liquids assume the shape of the container they're in. Like if you pour water into a glass, what shape is it? Well, it just fits in the glass. Right. It fits the shape because the particles in liquids move and flow freely. If you pour half a glass worth of water, it fits in half the glass. Well, that makes sense. Yeah, and liquids have a set volume, like solids. Volume is how much space something takes up. For example, a half a glass of water will never fill the cup to the top. But gases are trickier. The particles are separated with no arrangement or shape. Like the air or oxygen, it's everywhere. So gases go everywhere? Yeah, they just spread out to completely fill whatever container they're in. Okay. So the air I breathe is a gas. Are there any other gases? Yeah, there are lots of gases like the sun and the water vapor and clouds. But I thought water was a liquid. Well, a lot of things that may start out as solids or liquids can become gases, which brings me to my point about your steam. Water evaporates in heat and becomes a gas. Oh, yeah? So that's why the fire attack made the melted water turn into steam. You got it. Okay, let's prove we got it. I'm going to need your help. Click and drag each item into its proper state of matter bucket. Solid, liquid, or gas. Excellent. Cool.
cool. Nice work. You really know your stuff. Hey, I got an idea. Why don't we practice some more? You can make it all happen by helping us answer these questions about the three states of matter. Yeah, let's do it. Now tell me, which one isn't a state of matter? You got it. Which state of matter has particles that take the shape of the container they are in, but keep the same volume? Yeah! Which state of matter has a set shape and volume? All right! Which state of matter has no set shape or volume? Awesome! All right! We did it! Yeah! Well, we couldn't have done it without you. Now I guess it's break time. Yeah, I made some tea for everyone. It looks good, but it would be even better cold. Squirtle, ice beam! Squirtle! Whoops, guess that didn't exactly work out. Well, that is iced tea. <laughs> 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 Gases don't have a set volume or shape like liquids and solids. Try again. Solids have both a set shape and volume. Try again. Liquids have a set volume, but take the shape of the containers they are in. Try again. Try again. Oops, not that one. <laughs>